Okay, this chapter name is Forest Society and Colorism. Okay, so let's start. Take a quick look around your schools and home and identify all the things that you came from forest. Okay, we have to uh, look around in our uh, school and uh, our home that uh, what we what uh, are the, uh, sorry the things that are made up of forest it means with the help of that is the paper of in the books you are reading the decks and table doors windows and dyes that color your clothes spaces in your food the same <coughs> fan wrappers of your toffee tendulips in biddies gum berries and gum honey co coffee tea and rubber okay these are made up of forest it will stay do not miss out the do not miss out the oil and chocolates which comes from salsip okay uh, in the uh, oil sorry in the chocolate there is a oil that is come from salsip the tanning used to conserve skins and hides into leather are the herbs and roots used for the medicinal purpose okay and herbs are, and herbs are used for medicinal purpose like uh, you can say tulsi forests also provide bamboo wood for fuel grass charcoal packing of fruits flower animals birds and many other things in the amazon forest western ghats or in the western ghat it is possible to find as many as 15 different 500 different plants we all know that amazon is a, a forest okay where the 500 uh, or there is a one more place that is western ghats it is a possible to find many as many as 500 different types of plants okay species in one forest patch it means in one forest there is a 500 plus plants are available a lot of this diversity is fast disappearing between 700 and in 1995 okay so yes 700 and 1995 the period of industrialization 39 13.9 million square kilometer of forest or 9.3 percent of the world total area was cleared for industry industrial uses cultivation pasture and fuel it means the it, it means it na it means uh, what we can say 9.3 percent of the world's total area was cleared it means a uh, uh, tree uh, tree uh, cut it for cut for industrial use and for cultivation pasture okay this one is a, a tree that you can say here a sand forest in Chhattisgarh. Okay, this one is a fo sand forest that is in Chhattisgarh. Now, next one is why deforestation. We all know that deforestation it means the disappearance of plant or tree. Okay, so the disappearance of plant, the disappearance of forest is referred to as deforestation. It means the uh, if we cut the uh, cut the trees, uh, there is a or disappearance of trees so that forest is called that is called referred to as deforestation deforestation is not a recent problem the process began many centuries ago okay uh, this is not a recent problem okay this is also criticized in the centuries ago but under colonial rule it became more systematic but in the under colonial rule it is more systematic it means i think the, uh, there is a, some reduction of tree cutting okay reduced extensive let us look at the some of the causes of deforestation in india how what are the causes of deforestation in india first one is land to be improved in 1600 approx approximately one sixth of land one sixth of India's land mass was under cultivation. It means, in this is a uh, we are talking about in 1600. Okay, Appro approximately one sixth of India's land mass were under cultivation. It means there is a one sixth part of India's land mass was under cultivation. Okay, 
Now that figure has gone up to about half, but it uh, today it became half. As population increased over the centuries and the demand of food went up, it means we all know that if the population increases, the demand of food is also increases because uh, there are number of people who increases to it food. Peasants extended the boundaries of cultivation, clearing forest and breaking new land. It means for this they are work peasants. Okay, peasants are uh, uh, extending the boundaries of cultivation. It means if uh, in sixteen hundred there is a land boundary of this. Okay, and, and between this they used to cultivate crops. Okay, but uh, after. Increasing the population, they were increasing the land boundary to cultivate in large space. Okay, how they uh, use in large space? They cut. What they use? They are all. They cut trees to free up the. They cut trees to free up the space. Okay. So that the same thing is written here, clearing forest and breaking new land. Okay. In the colonial period, cultivation expanded rapidly for a variety of reasons. It means uh, cultivation expand in. This is a period of colonial period. In the colonial, this is a uh, sentence is about the colonial period. That in colonial period, cultivation expanded rapidly for the variety of reasons. First, the British is directly encouraged. When the valley was full, okay. First, the British directly encouraged the production of commercial crops like jute, wheat, and cotton. It means they directly what encouraged. It means they directly increase the production of. Uh, commercial crops like jute, sugar, wheat, and cotton. Okay. The demand of for these crops increased in nineteenth century. Okay. In uh, this is a uh, now this is in the nineteenth century, the demand of crops were increased. Okay. You know, for food grains were needed to feed growing urban population and raw materials were required for industrial it means growing or growing uh, uh, products uh, are used for what po uh, urban population and raw material for the industries production okay no second in the early morning Sorry, in the early 19th century, the colonial state that thought that the forests were unproductive, they were considered to be wildness that to be brought under cultivation so that the land could be held agriculture products and revenue and enhance in the income of state. Okay, it means early 19th century, they uh, they think that uh, the colonial state thought that the forest were Unproductive. It means forests are not necessary. Okay, they cannot give any pro uh, productive substance. They are unproductive, and they were considered to be wilderness. Okay, and that had to be brought under cultivation. It means they think that uh, in that forest that we cut the all the trees and use for the cultivation. Okay, that is more essential than. Forest rose by six points. So between eighteen hundred eighty to nineteen twenty, cultivated area rose by six point seven million hectare. Hectare. It means in uh, in eighteen eighty and in nineteen twenty, the cultivated area was how many? Six point seven million. Okay, we always because they cut all the trees for cultivation. Okay, see the expansion of cultivation as a sign of progress. But we should not forget that for land to be brought under the plow, forest have to be cleared. Okay, that I have already said that they 
cleared the forest for what they also create cleared the forest for the making locks into sleepers okay sleeper it means uh, the things that uh, we all know that in the train there is a but in nowadays the things is made up of cement okay we all know that this type of white white in color this one is white in color like this okay so but in nowadays it is made up of cement but uh, in earlier it is made up of wood okay this one is made up of wood for railway track that is something is written here wooden planks laid across railway tracks they would hold the tracks in the position by the early 19th century oak forest in england were despairing and uh, obviously if they uh, if they are if they cut the trees then the forest become <coughs> disappear and uh, this created a problem okay of uh, timber supply for the royal navy it means uh, they are cutting the trees and this became a problem that uh, they cannot supply timber for royal navy how could a ship be built without a regular supply of strong and durable timber how can be ships are what built without the this type of timber how could imperial power to be protected and maintained without ship and how could be this power is uh, uh, maintained without ships it means the ship is also important and food is also important next see what they do by the 1820s search parties were sent to explore the forest resources of india okay this uh, in the 1820 search parties and were sent to explore the forest resources of what india within a decade trees were being felled on a massive scale vast quantities of timber were being exported from india okay it means the vast uh, <coughs> vast country that uh, the quantities of uh, timber were being exported from only in india the spread of railway from 1850 created a new demand that railway was essential for continental trade it means railway is also essential and for railway they use what wood to make the sleepers trade for the movement of imperial troops okay to run locomotive wood was needed as fuel and also to lay railway line sleepers was essential to hold the tracks each miles of track required between 1760 to 2000 sleepers okay we need this is the amount of sleeper that we that they need for to make the sleeper from the 1816 the railway network expanded rapidly okay it means in the year 1860s the railway is used more and more by 1890 about 25 25500 th- km of track has been laid okay in 1946 the length of the tracks had increased to 7 lakhs 65000 km it means uh, it is further further increase is increasing uh, it's uh, what we can say increasing in kilometer they were using the railway in a more and more times as the railway tracks spread through india okay it means uh, by with the help of this the railway tracks are spread in all, all over the india a larger and a larger number of tree were felled obviously for tree for sleepers they would they would use wood so for wood they have to cut trees so early in the 1850 in madras presidency alone 35000 tree were being cut annually for sleepers okay it means 35000 trees were cut only for sleepers because the demand in, demand of railway station is also increases okay it is spread spread in all over india 
sorry, it, uh, spreads in all over the India and the government gave out the contracts to individual to supply the required quantities. The co these contractors began cutting trees indiscriminately, forest around the railway track, fast stair display. Okay, this one is the slipper that is, sorry, this one is a timber that is carried out by elephant. Locks of the tree. Okay. MP25, it means from Madhya Pradesh. Next one is plantation. Let's see. Large area of natural forest were also cleared to make way for tea, coffee and rubber plant. Also, we need basic need, need like uh, tea, coffee, rubber, plantation to meet your growing need for these commodities. Okay. The colonial group government took over the forest and gave vast areas to European planters at cheap rate. Okay. These areas were enclosed and cleared of forest and plant with tea or coffee. Okay. It means they cut to the forest, cleared the forest and they plant the, the place with tea and coffee. Now the rise of commercial forestry we will read in uh, next video so I think you understand all the video of uh, that what is deforestation and what are the causes of deforestation. Okay, obviously for daily basis uh, we, we uh, are cutting the trees for our basic needs like uh, you can see here that for the sleepers they, they would uh, cut the trees sorry they are cutting the trees more and more amount and also for the timbers that is used for uh, seeps and for the uh, helping of oh, royal levy okay so i hope you understand whole the video that's all for today and in next video we will start the forest the rise of commercial forestry okay this is the, our second part of this chapter so we will start in next video that's all for today thank you have a nice day